Dragon Age Origins Awakening, it was rated M for Mature by the ESRB and contains blood, intense violence, language, partial nudity, and sexual content. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everybody, my name is Amaranth, and I play games for the internet and today we're playing Dragon Age Origins Awakening. Uh, last time we did some missions in the city of Amaranthine and rediscovered for a second time that Nathaniel's sister is there so we have to go back. <clears throat> In between episodes, I cleared up our inventory, as you can see, and oh, we now have enough to get the, uh, to give to the guy to start rebuilding the keep. So we'll do that, but first... You know, I'm actually not the first how to be a Grey Warden. Carrying on a family tradition, then. Following in my grandfather's footsteps, more like. His name was Padrick Howe. He joined the Order before it returned to Ferelden, just after the war. Never contacted his family again. Just vanished. Now that I know about the joining, I think he died. Mm. And the Howes were never told. Told what? The joining is a secret. Father always said he was a horrible man for abandoning the family to join a pointless cause. I grew up ashamed of my grandfather. But now I see his bravery. That will take some getting used to. The only shame was your father's. My father often forgot that nobility has another meaning. I told you that the bow you gave me was my grandfather's, didn't I? Thank you for that. At any rate, we should probably get back to it. There are dark spawn to kill, I'll bet. Somewhere. Oh, Nathaniel. <laughs> um, how do you feel about me? 63, warm. Uh. Actually... Hey, may I be of service? I'd like to have something enchanted. Of course. Orders. Damn. May I be of service? Mm, nope. Farewell, mm. Commander. May I point out that you're all right? I'm all right. And remarkably lovely, if I'm allowed to say. Really, when the Templars came for me, you could have decided I wasn't worth the trouble. But I apparently am worth the trouble. Considering I'm usually a lot of trouble, I should be grateful. Mm. I'm glad to have you around. I'm glad to be around. When you recruited me, I thought I was jumping from the frying pan into the fire. But being a warden is almost tolerable. It's a pleasant stroll through the park with Darkspawn. <laughs> so glad I could make it happen for you. You're a giver. I'm very grateful. I thought it was worth mentioning. Thank you, Commander, for everything. <laughs> I guess that's because we got to a hundred percent. Need something pummeled? Just say the word. Mm, cask? I think a blister on my foot just exploded. Oh, he is kind of gross sometimes. So okay. Um. Commander. Nothing. Uh, you. Commander. Report on the situation in the Arling? The soldiers are doing their best to defend the farmlands. It's a lot of ground to cover, though. Master Wade has been at the forge night and day. New arms will make our soldiers much more effective, sir. Scouts report darkspawn throughout the Arling and amassing. 
Where the soldiers aren't patrolling, the land is dangerous, Commander. Very dangerous. Oh well. Good day, Commander. Right. Anyway. So we got to talk to them. I wonder who yes, we'll take uh, with us. Yes. Where you at? People talk about me stinking up the joint. What are you on about now? Cat piss. Little kitty there makes me want to vomit. Don't listen to him, Sir Pouncelot. You smell just fine. I don't suppose you've reconsidered? Coin comes and goes, but dwarven walls never fall. I can spare 80 sovereigns. This had better be worth it. It will be, Warden. Good luck to anyone who tries to breach these walls. Ha! Okay. Mm. That's there. Forcing me, me, to come to this dreadful turnip keep. Oh, the indignity. You're back. You need anything? Nothing, never mind. Come back soon. Thank you. I emptied out my stores blasting those dark spawn. Once we're done with repairs, we should talk. Mm. The men are still clearing the rubble in the basement. They'll be finished soon. Right. So, now that that's taken care of, and... Oof! <laughs> what a blow to the wallet! Um... Did, did, did. Let's pop back here and then we'll go over to the Wending Wood. Get trade going as fast as we can. Also, we picked up gifts. Uh, along the way and the ones that I didn't give to people I um, I put away in the uh, in the box just pop in tiptoe through the tulips Delilah? Is that really you? Nathaniel! I had feared the worst. Mm. Times must have been hard, Delilah. But you can do better than this. Come back to the estate until we find somewhere else. What? <laughs> oh, Nathaniel, I didn't marry Albert out of desperation. I adore him. I was so glad to get away from Father's evil. This life is so much better. Father's evil? Isn't that overstating things a little? He got caught up in politics. You weren't here. You didn't see what he did, Nathaniel. You want the culprit who destroyed our family? It was him, without question. I... had no idea. Of course you did. But you always worshipped Father, right from when you were a little boy. Come, brother. Let us sit and catch up a bit, shall we? She said she wants me to come back, once all this is done. Meet her husband. She's due by the spring. She seems happy. She said father deserved to die. I still can't believe it. He did deserve to die. He was an evil man. I thought he had his reasons. It was a war for Andraste's sake. Before I went to the free marches, he was never... How could he have changed so much? It's not your fault, Nathaniel. What if I'd never left? I didn't have much choice, but still, 
I wish I'd known some of this sooner. I feel like such a fool. Now, please, let's get back to our business. I need to think. Nathaniel approves plus three. I'm sure there was more that I could have said to have made him like me more. But we're at 66. Anyway, every time, every time, uh, I hear his sister's name is Delilah, I'm just like, Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in Amaranthine? <laughs> And then that just, that one bit gets stuck in my head and I'm in hell. Uh... Oh. But the Knotwood Hills. Hmm, and the Winding Wood. Let's look at our journal. The Winding Wood has all this stuff. Knotwood Hills is that Shadows of Violet one. <sighs> yeah, let's go to Wending Wood. We'll go to Wending Wood, from there we'll go to the Black Marsh, and from there we'll go to Knotwood. Or... Mm, yeah, and from there we'll go to Knotwood. labor the point or anything but I think this caravan was attacked just a bit fine silk caravan was smashed to bits simple bandal bandits could not have done this should be easy enough much damage Timothy! Oh, I'm itchy. On it. Find silks. Scroll. This should be easy enough. Orders to the militia. On it. Oh, I was gonna do a codex reading. God dang it. I forgot. I'm sorry. Yeah, women are draw to you when you play with that cat. 
like moths to a flame. Women like it when men show affection for small, fuzzy, defenseless beings like you. Yeah, stupid mage. Every time I pull something out of my robes, the women just flee. Do you actually think you have a chance? started. Hello, Timothy. Oh, God. A little frantic, huh? I can see why. Right, a charred Sylvan wouldn't have any.
caravan. Rash fine. As you wish. Merchant's goods. Found six of nine silks. Nice. Uh, three of eight inscriptions. Haven't found the botanist. You found the destroyed caravans. Bandits were looting it, but it's unlikely they did this much damage themselves. Could have been the Sylvans? That's seven of nine. Eight of nine. Let's make it quick, shall we? Right. Nine of nine. Um. Pardon me. Make a copy of the inscriptions. Whoops. Um second. Okay. Um, four of eight. Yep. Nine of nine. Four of eight. Ogren. Out of my way! I need to get out of here! What's wrong? Can I help? No! No one can help me! I just need to get out of here! Who's after you? Uh, the elf! She makes the trees come alive! All we wanted was some easy money from the caravans, but we're... Make her help me. She's here. Gotta get away. Hmm. Another daily. I recall you from the last gathering of the clans. Your keeper is Marathari, is she not? Yes, she is. Adaran Atashan's sister. I was with our keeper, Ilshe, when she spoke to Marathari. I am Valana. Watch your back around these parts. There are dark spawn, and the Shem settlements do not look kindly on the Dalish. Why was that man afraid of you? These caravans belong to the forest now. He wanted to take that which was not his. The guild did not mention Dalish elves. Guild? You work with the Shems? Have you no shame? Do you know what they did? They stole my sister, and likely sold her to merchants. I will not rest until I have her back. You should go. I have no quarrel with you, and I would hate for that to change. So... The guild didn't mention... Trading slaves, either. The Wending Woods says. An angry elven woman in the Wending Woods says the human merchants captured her sister. It's clear she's responsible for the attacks on the caravan. Stop her before she kills again. Um... On it. <laughs>
I just can't help but feel like there's another piece of the puzzle we're missing. Should be easy enough. survivor <laughs> don't look don't look at me oh who are you Olaf my name came with friends to to drive out away the elf but the dark spawn were too quick. We were ripped apart, biting claws and teeth from the darkness, and then I woke, flesh and bone and gristle under me, around me. Everyone dead. Dead, soft meat melting into the ground. I, I crawled away, came here. Can't stand to see it. Did you kill the elves? Er... Hmm. Kill them. Do you know anything about the elf sister? Sister? I have a sister. Do I? Elf sister? No. We did not take her. Probably dead. Or eaten. Did you kill the elves? No. No. Darkspawn came first. They slaughtered us. Took our steel. Brought it to the elven camp. Tricked us. Tricked the elf. Now, she thinks we are to blame. Hunts all in her rage while they watch. So all these people died over a misunderstanding? Maker, that's horrible. We have to stop her. Tell her she's wrong. If we search the woods more thoroughly, we might be able to find her again. The Dark Ones are curious about you, too. They watch you as well as her. Can you feel them? Where did the Darkspawn come from? Beneath. Around. From shadows. This disease will kill you, you know. I'm already dead. I'm already gone. Make... make an end. Please. As you wish. Perfect creature. Trap. 
hate the laughing. <sighs> Meanwhile. Open trinket. Let's get started. Oh! Timothy, look, friends! <laughs> You're getting sloppy! This should be Jimothy. the trading trouble is, but let's... Blood Lotus... Statue, Rash Fine. Charred Corpse. Corpse Pile.
dark spawn corpse. Trading terminals. Let's do Inus. Five of eight. Three more of those. This place is a death trap. If I need to step in the bushes to answer nature's call, you're coming with me. <laughs> This should be statue. easy enough. Death root. What do you want from me? Don't you understand? I have to do this to get Sarani back. The humans did not kidnap your sister. I know a human crime when I see it. I've experienced more than enough of them. You will pay for repeating their lies. A wolf to death? Uh, kick a tree to death? Maybe. is back over th if we can let's go deal with the enough of this hmm This should be easy enough. Right. Hmm. What is built and doors? But, right, we were... <sighs> Dark spawn. Destroy the fiend. Let's get started. Yay. 
firebolt. This should be easy enough. Fire arrow. Hmm. has been a long time. I have forgotten my name, but I am a warrior. I am Avar, and I am cursed. An Avar barbarian? They have been gone for centuries. Not entirely true, but... Far longer than that. Seasons beyond counting. I was a man. A man to be feared. A man of war. The Teventa mages, they came here seeking easy prey. But they found me, my brother, my tribe. We broke their army at the fort of a thousand vigils. Then pursue the Magister. Fort of a Thousand Vigils? You mean Vigils Keep? Perhaps. Time changes all things. We cornered the Magister here. Here we would sacrifice him to Yuvola, the god of this wood. As his guards fell one by one, he struck my brother and I with liquid fire. So even as the Magister's body was torn apart, my brother and I watched from stone eyes. Can I do anything for you then? Or... Tell me about your people. We know little of you now. So much forgotten. I remember only revenge. The Tevinter Magister that cursed my brother and I, he leads a mockery of life. Disturb the ashes nearby. Summon him. Kill him. Free me. Stranger. No, I'm here. My brother called to you. Do not listen. The Magister's death will accomplish nothing. Was your brother lying then? I have never known him to speak a falsehood. But he is mistaken. My brother is consumed by rage. Over long years, his anger grows. Anger will not free us. Revenge will not free us. I've used the long years to think, to pray to our gods. What will free you then? There is no release, but with peace, serenity, we can sleep. I have slept many seasons with only my brother's anger to call me back. Show him the way. This does not have to be a torment. And he seems pretty intent on murdering the Magister. He is the son of the father, a warrior born. With the long seasons, I have seen that violence often accomplishes naught. Teach him. Hmm. Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Mm. You know, this is not the first time that we've seen living statues 
essentially uh, cursed by Tevinter mages. If you, if you go back and watch the uh, mage opening, there was one who one was a woman who had the gift of prophecy. And yeah. The deed is not yet done. Your brother says the Magister's death won't free you. My brother has grown weak. In truth, weakness was always in him. He was a thinker, a dreamer, not a warrior. In a thousand years, has no one killed the Magister? Twice before he has been struck down. Once very long ago. Once by an Alamari game. This anger doesn't help you. It's agony, right? This life of Earth is beyond bearing. The Magister stirs from his ashes and my blood boils. He yet lives. Anger imprisons you. Release it, and it will release you. What you ask is difficult. My soul calls out to smite he who cursed my brother and me. The curse cannot be lifted. You must make peace with it. Quest updated. You... you have calmed him. If it lasts, perhaps we can sleep and wake in a brighter future. Thank you. Both of you rest easy. You deserve it. Before I sleep, let me whisper to you of Law of the Earth, our secret herbs. May they help you, stranger. Good night. Nathaniel approves, plus two. Nice. Okay, we're going to stop here, and next time we will deal with Valana. <sighs> right. Until then. Bye-bye.